every pandemic in the last 150 years, there was an, a quantum leap in the electrification of the Earth. In 1918, late, uh, late fall of 1917, there was the introduction of radio waves around the world. And then starts in World War II with the next pandemic, with the introduction of radar equipment all over the Earth, blanketing the entire Earth in radar fields. First time humans have ever been exposed to that. In 1968, there was the Hong Kong flu, and we put satellites emitting radioactive frequencies in the Van Allen belt. Within six months, we had a new viral pandemic. In the last six months, with the electrification of the Earth, and I'm sure a lot of you know what that is, it's called 5G. If anybody want to make one guess as to where the first completely blanketed 5G city in the world was. Exactly. In 1918, after the um, uh, huge, biggest pandemic, the Spanish flu pandemic of 1918, Steiner was asked, what was this all about? And he said, well, viruses are simply excretions of a toxic cell. He said, well, viruses are simply excretions of a toxic cell. He said, well, viruses are simply excretions of a toxic cell. Viruses are pieces of DNA or RNA with a few other proteins. They butt out from the cell. They happen when the cell is poisoned. They are not the cause of anything. And the cells get poisoned. They try to purify themselves by excreting debris, which we call viruses. If you, if you go to the current theory of viruses called exosomes in the latest head of the NIH giving a talk on the complexity of viruses, you will see this is perfectly in line with the current thinking on what a virus really is. Every pandemic in the last 150 years, there was an, a quantum leap in the electrification of the Earth. In 1918, late, uh, late fall of 1917, there was the introduction of radio waves around the world. Whenever you expose any biological system to a new electromagnetic field, you poison it, you kill some, and the rest go into a kind of suspended animation so that, interestingly, they live a little bit longer and sicker. And then starts in World War II with the next pandemic with the introduction of radar equipment all over the Earth, blanketing the entire Earth in radar fields. First time humans have ever been exposed to that. In 1968, there was the Hong Kong flu, and it was the first time the Earth has a protective layer in the Van Allen belt, which essentially integrates the cosmic uh, fields from the sun and the Earth, from the moon and Jupiter, etc., integrates that and essentially distributes that to the living beings of the Earth. And we put satellites emitting radioactive frequencies in the Van Allen belt. Within six months, we had a new viral pandemic. Why viral? Because the people are poisoned, they excrete toxins, they look like viruses, people think it's, an, it's a flu epidemic. In the 1918 the, uh, epidemic, the Boston Health Department decided to investigate the contagiousness of this, so they, believe it or not, took hundreds of people with the flu, and they sucked the snot out of their nose and injected it into the healthy people who didn't have the flu, and not one time could they make the next person sick. They did this over and over again, and they were not able to demonstrate contagion. They even did it with horses who apparently got the Spanish flu and they put bags over their head and the horses sneezed in the bag and they put the bag over the next horse and not one horse got sick. You can read about this in a book called The Invisible Rainbow by Arthur Furstenberg who chronicles all the steps in the electrification of the earth and how within six months 
there was a new flu pandemic all over the world. And when you invest, when you hear the normal uh, explanations, how did it go from Kansas to South Africa in two weeks? So the entire world got the symptoms at the same time, in spite of the fact that the mode of transportation was horseback and boats, and there's no explanation for it. They just say, we don't know how that happened. But when you think about it, with these radio waves and other frequencies that some of you have in your pocket and on your wrist, you can send a signal to Japan and it arrives instantaneously. So any of you who don't believe there is an electromagnetic field that communicates globally within seconds just is not paying attention to this. And I will only finish by pointing out that there has been a dramatic and quantum leap in the last six months with the electrification of the Earth. And I'm sure a lot of you know what that is. It's called 5G. Thanks for waking up with us. Drop till there's nothing left until we pass out Keeping us around to clean up the mess and take the garbage out But we'll be trash next Create catastrophes to speed up the process Depopulation, agenda progress News tell half-truths, hidden in plain sight They know we can Gave a cyanide They know we don't see it it. They know They know you can't see it it. What they've done to us Open your eyes Lemonade Don't drink the Kool-Aid It ain't safe for us They made it so sweetly So we Fabricated knowledge, false education, stand innovation for my degree in indoctrination. Georgia Godstones plainly tell us that they plan to eliminate us. Conspiracy theory, we see no dilemma as they quietly wipe our billions. They know we don't see. They know you can't see it They know What they done to us Taking the Like Geppetto, pulling the strings, master plan, dumb us all down, eat what they feed us, try not to think, carry on, nothing to see, as they continue with their killing spree, we wasting time on trivial things and buy what they sell, even deceit, keeping us blinded, buying their music, so but of course, they think we're stupid, they love to lie, cause they're deluded, we speak the truth, but then we get muted. Games and smartphones holding us captive TV keeping the sheep distracted Desperate to bring in their global system So they resort 
to do in the drastic Man made disease, cause on our illness Healthcare illusions, curing no sickness Get all our shots and death in the clinic Cause big pharma is big, big business Monger and fear to maintain a lie That we need them just to survive Brainwash to keep their pockets lined Watching the blind, leading the blind Yet they say Believe us, elect us, trust we never lie Funny how they left that part out They can't wait for us to die That I vote, it means nada Cause they pre-select the chief And the pay off the nation's debt They ransom you and me Listen, we marionettes And they got us in the trance When them puppeteers pull them strings The whole world gon' dance It ain't over, it ain't over Jesus Christ is coming quickly When he swing his sword They, they, they they gon' be feeling slim when they Don't drink the Kool-Aid It ain't safe for us They made it so sweetly So it will be easy To carry their plans out To eliminate them Lemonade Don't drink the Kool-Aid It ain't safe for us they made it too easy While we're busy sleeping they carry their plans out to eliminate all us. The world today has 6.8 billion people. That's headed up to about 9 billion. Now, if we do a really great job on new vaccines, health care, reproductive health services, we could lower that by 10 or 15%.